The uncertainties brought on by COVID-19 extending to college-bound high school seniors and the institutions themselves, wondering how it would impact decisions. The picture coming into focus now that the deadline has passed. For St. A's, the enrollment has been as strong as it normally is, um, which is great. Uh, it obviously means that a lot of students still want to come to colleges. St. Anselm stuck to its May 1st deadline, but many like Colby Sawyer gave students another month to decide. We certainly saw more after May 1st than in previous years given the June 1 deadline. Um, we did see a nice uptick the last couple days uh, and we've exceeded our budgetary goal. The pandemic leading some students to reconsider how far away they want to go to college. UNH excited to see a year-over-year -year increase in in-state students. Colby Sawyer too. We actually saw a 13% increase in enrollment from students from New Hampshire. An uptick in transfers back to New Hampshire and a huge jump in certain programs. Our nursing enrollment grew almost 40% this year from last year. So students are looking to pick the right place. They want to feel good about their choice and they want to feel good that the institution is doing the right things. Now, UNH is still analyzing its deposit data, but it expects, expects a freshman class of over 2,700 students and Plymouth reporting it's on track to rival last year. We're live in Portsmouth, Jennifer Crompton, WMUR News 9.